So, a lot of you people asked me to watch Maxor's newest video. Genshin Impact is a playable anime, and a lot of you asked me to watch it, so I guess we're gonna just jump right into it and uh, check it out. A cry for help. Genshin Impact is a playable anime, and that's pretty good since dude, my- Dude, his editing makes me sick every single time I watch him. Videos are attempts to make watchable anime. I can't believe it, guys. They made a sequel to Stockholm Syndrome. Welcome to the yeah. world of Tavot. You may have heard of it from all the free advertising that I'm doing. A beautiful post-apocalyptic night- I love, uh, I love doing free advertising for Genshin Impact. Mare World featuring a giant tree. Uh, Wait, sorry, that's the wrong game. On our journey throughout the seven nations, we will meet the world's most colorful cast of children. Entrusted and empowered hey, by the Oh, gods, we... I, oh, someone on Twitter just literally freaked out, calling them children? Bro, they're 6,000 years old. Build elemental energy as dangerously as possible. I'm just a big fan of the characters in this game. There is no reason in particular. Assemble your team of heroic psychopaths and begin blasting, loading, yeah. cooking your enemies alive. Visiting baby's first casino. And with enough time, it will become baby's last casino. Oh my god damn, why is this so true? But most importantly, have fun, because the game will try to stop you. I can assure you that the visual <laughs> novels are exactly what Da Wei intended. So join me as I navigate one of the most beautiful, fantastical, and expensive game worlds ever made. One agonizing country at a time. This is it guys, this is what 900 million dollars can buy you. Are you having fun yet? Look, all I'm trying to say is, uh, this is a weird episode of Ava. I like waifus that pull swords out of their boobs too because I get to look at the sword. Damn, they just murdered a baby. Playable anime. Dude, this guy's editing is insane. Wow, I haven't been here in uh, two years. Welcome back to Mondstadt. And yes, the game still displays your IP address, just in case you're a little bit- Oh yeah, I heard about this. Uh, some Niji talent got in real trouble because like, hey, you're not allowed to show your real life stuff. Too critical. This place is where the player learns how to fight, learns how to kill innocent animals, learns that they're yeah, bisexual America. as soon as they see Kaya. So I think it's a great opportunity to teach the basics and uh, nothing else. The environment here looks like it shares a polygon. I think a good place to start is with our team, the Fuelgunasaria. Official, every crew got the schizophrenic, personality disorder. Yeah! Mentally and physically deranged. A wife material. I'm, uh, serious about that. There's a quest where you enter her mind and she fights her tulpa. End user license agreement. Literally the only physical DPS. Possibly racist. Has the biggest slappy in Teyvat. Sang- You could've just started with that. Sang- Sang- Cock. And Rosaria, who is dressed promiscuously, so we need to cover her up in appropriate garments. God, I wish nuns were real. With our team assembled, we are now able to <laughs> do nothing because I haven't explained the game. Genshin Impact is a- There's no game! It's just waifus! Based character RPG where each character wields one of the seven elements, all of them interacting completely nonsensically. Water buffs fire, ice freezes water, plants buff electricity, a fucking gas leak. Dendro requires nine tabs of Khan Academy. My team is based on not playing the game as much as possible. There is genuinely no cooldown to freeze. By the way, what I'm showing you now is considered tame. The game is actually supposed to look some mentally deranged. The numbers are helping me to understand what's happening. Of course, some characters- <laughs> Dude, I love when they do that in uh, all forms of like shooter type game. When, when they just show you like a collage of numbers, you use so many attacks and they just put like a number collage. No one's calculating this shit. Others are bad and others are very bad, but many are absolutely game changing. There are characters that straight up allow me to fly, at least through a uh, regular means. This one fights with a pogo stick and this one doesn't fight at all. My cock's crit rate is negative 87. The game also allows us to choose from uh, a lot of weapons. I think I have a few copies, each one with their own properties and substats. Sometimes too many substats, like goddamn I'm fighting with a Wikipedia page. We've got bows, spears, paddles, big fish sent to you yeah! child's bomb instructions Dude, this is just anime i love how in anime everyone's like okay so uh the weapon of choice here is a yo-yo or a fishing rod <laughs> i hope you can see why there's a lot of variation and also theory crafting a lot of chinese theory crafting they take this game very seriously like right outside of a kfc seriously and if you're wondering about the gambling well hell we'll get to it later i have a lot to say about it but for now welcome to the land of the anemo god who is a twink that gets kicked in the balls yeah fanboys getting kicked in the balls is basically the internet's favorite thing this guy's, uh, really jamming out. No chat, I'm not going to do that yoinky-sploinky. Oh my god, he just doesn't give a fuck. So what if I just, uh...
Oh no, he can't be stopped. Well, I guess if he can't beat him. Mondstadt is a depopulated anarchist state where there are no taxes, no police. No taxes, take me to Mondstadt. Peace. And half the country is controlled by wolves. Wolves that you uh, never actually see, unless you want to count Razor. I mean, there's the giant wolf, but he's kind of special. Uh, what the dog doing? As a result of this, nobody in Mondstadt has any money. Except for the church, of course. The city is undergoing a crippling hundreds of years of history. <laughs> wine epidemic. Look, I just think it's a serious funding issue when the cavalry captain doesn't have a horse. Therefore, most of your time is going to be spent cleaning up their mess. Their singular mess. Because there is only one enemy in my- Dude, I love how there's a plot. He's trying so hard to make believe that there's a plot. They just put her ass on the screen. This is why people are playing the game. Because of this butt. No one's playing this game their for mess. the plot. It's wild. Their like, did you, did you see her butt there for a second? I didn't see any plot. Mess. Because there is only one enemy in Mondstadt. Yes, from the beautiful ruins of old to the peaks of Dragonspine, 90% of the enemies you encounter are Hillagerals, a sentient race capable of empathy and complex thoughts, which is why they must be destroyed. Makes Literally sense. take Makes a sense. random location in Mondstadt. You are 10 seconds away from a Hillagerl. Well, why is that one unbirthing its self? Really cool that the only organization in Mondstadt is dedicated to race war. They even have their own life. Damn. Every time I see those butts, I'm like, I should play Genshin Impact, and I slap myself. I'm like, God damn it! Why am language, I? Language which I'm being why? based on. Why? Well, I'm not gonna play this game just for the butt. I can just go to Rule 34. I don't need to play the game for it. Honestly, I'm a bit of a yay Dada man myself. Really feeling that. Dude, look at that lore. Look at all that lore. All the lore is Stevie and Hank. Stevie and Hank again. Look at his lore. Look at all the lore. Muhu yay today. Don't say Nini Zito. It's basically a slur. They uh, didn't like that. Look, what I'm trying to say is this. She has her her coat thing. But it spreads just enough here. Just Stevie! Stevie and hates! It spread perfectly so that you could see the butt move when she walks. I'm trying to say is this place has problems, but ultimately they are cool problems. Oh my god, she doesn't even need any any yeah, secrets didn't like or that. tricks. Look, what I'm trying to say is this place has problems, but ultimately Dude! You are literally getting everything you could possibly want with playing this game. Ultimately, they are cool problems. Mondstadt may not be that varied, well designed, or even have a story that I can't summarize in one sentence. The dragon was mean, and then he was nice. Let's freaking go! Bible passages. Sun Tzu. But ultimately, this is just the beginning of a long, long journey. This game is planned out of- You see what I'm saying? Seven years in advance. So as far as the basics go, there is no better teacher than Mondstadt. But uh, pretty much just the basics. I don't think I'm staying for the boss fights. I did, what is happening? What the fuck am I seeing? People make fun of the Elden Ring camera. Okay. Yeah! Can you stop playing for a sec. No. Music! I need to go to my teapot! <laughs> For the next stop on our War Crimes Tour of the Balkans, we're heading to the Funny Nation. Post about this nation to instantly gain yeah. ready karma. And for that, we're going to need to climb as high as we can so we can deduce the direction. So, uh, we're going to this location on the map. If only there was a better way to view the world. Make sure to land on the elevator. Next, we're going to, uh... Shit. We're going to, uh... One second. We're going to ascend to space. I do it. Yeah! Well, why does that work like that? Oh my god, the planet's receding. I am alone in this hell on Earth. I like think I'm, uh, I think I'm gonna be here for a little bit. You know it's real bad when the moon is physically below you. Hang on, guys, it's getting kind of dark, so I'm just gonna uh, change the time real quick. <laughs> yeah, the game lets you do that. <laughs> well, folks, it was nice knowing you all. Damn. Never mind. They all have bigger boobs than Fifi? I know, even the chill- Hey guys, Maxor here, and welcome to, uh, China. I it's just China. Zhaoshang Haoshang Wo, Shan Zai, Wo Yo, Bing Chiling, Wo Han Shi Huan, Bing Chiling. I really hope I didn't just tank my social credit. In our previous of adventures, we explored Mondstadt to learn the basic mechanics, and also, um, race relations. So for Li Wei, yeah. we're going to learn that we've been playing the game wrong. But before I can get to that, I need to explain my team. I call it the uh, hot shower by force. Lord knows we need it. Xing Zhu, Xing Zhu, Xi Jinping. Yes, this is a man. Yeah. I know it's hard to tell. He is also ridiculously broken on account of his ability to make enemies wet. Interp Yo! I am also a male that can make enemies wet. We have so much in common. Put that information however you want. Hu Tao is the owner of a funeral parlor and she could use a bit of new business. She is also the winner of the most terrifying Simpsons Award. Like, the thread just doesn't end. He's still writing them. Most reasonable Hu Tao main. Yolan is a character that I play for the 
personality. She's also one of the most overpowered units in the game because she's the second Shingsho. I don't even care that she's a federal psyop. I can fix her. And Toma, who is fucking spelled wrong. Just a, just, just don't build Toma. With our team assembled, we are now able to trivialize the combat because this team is ridiculous. But fortunately, Genshin is not just a game about combat. It it's a game about being horny. It's a game about gambling. It is what we call a gotcha game, because it has got me in its grasp. Which means that the primary game mechanic is chance. Every character is chance. Every weapon is chance. Every piece of every build is fucking chance. Yeah! Do you know what it's like to have a mathematically impossible goblet? Goddamn elating. Hey, so I see you're trying to level up your crit rate. Well, that's a weird way to spell defense. But fortunately, we can predict the outcomes of our character roles using some Eastern philosophies. And the answer is, um, 105 on average. But don't worry, you've got a lot of time. Wait, hold up. You can't even level your stats? Can't pick which stat you level? Dude, I have only played as much Genshin Impact as I needed to for the sponsor. Genshin sponsored me a few times. That's how much Genshin I actually played. Dude, they are literally the ultimate money printing simulator for, for me, Hoyo. I'm, uh, I, I guess we're gonna wait a day. Because only a few five stars are actually available. And sometimes they aren't available for 483 days. She is in prison for racism. But what are they going to do? Lock me up? So naturally we- Wait, what? Oh, this is the dude. Can't, can't have a community without one pedophile. So naturally we need to feed our gambling addiction at any cost. And there's a few ways to do that. You could explore more, go on fantastic adventures, or find amazing treasures if you want to stay poor. No, you see, the real money is made in the daily quests, which are a series of useful and normal missions, such as talking to people, murdering those people, talking to the hillagers very nicely, finding the weasel, w where do you go, and j jumping on mushrooms. Who the fuck commissioned me to do this? We also have the power to send various characters on 20-hour expeditions directly to the coal mines. Look, guys, I really need these 2,000 upgrade materials. It's just uh, best you don't think about it too hard. Greetings, traveler. Uh -huh. Episode. Okay. What can I do for you today? Yeah, I'd like to uh send a child to the coal mines. What? Put her in for 20 hours. But traveler, she's going to die. The lithium is not going to mine itself, Catherine. But that Iron Mouse, Iron Mouse is always his random people. But traveler, do not question me, Catherine, or I'll have you stabbed in a future quest. Way is an authoritarian militaristic oligarchy controlled by a committee of really hot lesbians. I believe in- You should have started with that! It's run by hot lesbians? Dude, this game is just so smart. Gone you supremacy. This nation is the land of contracts, and by entering, you have made the contract to not criticize the state. Con so it's America. Consequently, Li Wei is also where all money is printed on the planet. So, so, uh, so it's America. I guess Monstat's economy is powered by hopes and dreams. And also, uh, the card game. Look, Timmy, I know your dad's dead and all, but do you want to play Gwent? A minor side effect of this is that Li Wei is in the midst of a violent crime epidemic. As in, the majority of enemies in Li Wei are human. And even worse, they're poor. So oh no. No, it's poor. Oh, but this is so sad. Hold on. No, it's just poor people <laughs> trying for No, they're poor people rising up. They want to end the capitalistic overlords and you murder them. <laughs> oh, you are what Twitter swore to destroy. So poor, in fact, that they're forced to fight you with Molotov cocktails and farming equipment. What is what is your plan, my guy? The masculine urge to dig a hole. By the way, we're the good guys. Speaking of digging holes, I should oh. probably address this. That's just so sad. That's China! It's a little difficult to ignore. You see, there are many beautiful places to see in Li Wei, such as Night City, the fucking rice- You like see, there are many beautiful places to see in Li Wei, such as- I don't know, I see two beautiful things I'm looking at right now, homie. I don't know if you need to go any further. I just saw the two nicest things. Night City, the fucking rice fields, the most annoying place to navigate on the earth. Like, please stop giving me commissions here. And then we have the Chasm, which is a secret underground labyrinth containing all of the game's Eldritch Horrors. And yes, this is just the entrance to the Chasm. Yeah, there's no sound effect for that. If you die down here, no one will hear your screams. As soon as you think you're done exploring, it just it just keeps going down. The devs had to add moon shoes to the game so I could keep playing it. Now that we're trapped down here, we only have two options remaining. We need to mine and we need to craft. The second part will come later. Okay, so now it's later. Unfortunately, I cannot craft a sense of humor. Look, what I'm trying to say Damn. is Li Wei is a very diverse place. It's certainly more diverse than Hillitrol Field number six. But most importantly, Li Wei is a land of questions. What secrets lie in this mysterious land? What adventures are still to be had? Am I gay now? It's almost enough Damn. to make you forget the nightmare pit. And look, Li Wei might have a few... Dies? 
Liyue has thighs. Issues with organized crime, sea monster attacks, it happens twice, and the landscape always trying to kill me. But hey, at least the story's up. It's okay. Can anyone, can anyone here tell me why, 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 like there's a, <laughs> why there's like a giant bird next to me? It's weird. Oh fuck, where am I? <laughs> Diagon Alley. Bruh. I don't know, every time I see someone trying to explain Genshin plot to me, it's just so wild. Just every single time someone tries to explain Genshin plot, I just get totally lost. Because not even the people explaining the plot care about the plot. What's up, gang? It's me, Arutakito! What? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was that? Okay, guys, listen. We need to reach Japan. Don't worry. I have a plan to bypass immigration. We are going to walk there. Yeah! Yes, that's right. We're going to... Excuse me. We're going to travel underneath the ocean. So apparently I just have to, um... Uh-huh. Ah. That actually worked. Okay, I think I've, uh... Made a mistake. It's time to descend into the abyssal zone. Just to watch out for the void. Uh, what do I do about this? So I think I've been walking for, uh, 20 minutes. I don't like this anymore. Okay, we're pretty close now, so, uh, I don't think we're close enough. Please no, please no, please no. I, d d d how am I drowning there? What is up, my thadies and gentle vamps? Welcome to the land of Inazuma, a home uh, to nobody because no one is probably housed in Inazuma. Previously, Monsat taught us how to play, and Lee Wade taught us how to simp. Well, the land of lightning is here yeah. to teach us that we have not felt true pain yet. But first, let's go over our team, which I will be calling the, uh, Yandere Benzos. Yaiviko, yeah! Mami Sari, Sigma Female, kidnapped a man and force feminized him. God, I wish that was me. What? <laughs> How many times? Why? Traveler, I'm making a call-out post to my Twitter.com. What the fuck are you saying? I'm gonna piss on the fucking moon. <laughs> Bruce. You can literally name him Bruce. That is actually how it appears in-game. In fact, we can name him all kinds of things, such as Baby Girl, Dr. Ligma, Wobusha Dr. Wall, Ball, Ballfart, Testicles. What is that? And last but not least, Hukashish. Oh, Hatsune yeah! Miku. This is literally just Miku. Like, they didn't even try to hide it. And what's the problem with that? Miku has simps. And Bennett, who is the single most overpowered unit in the game. Like, Genshin doesn't have power creep because of Bennett. Send this bitch to the coal mines and have his testicles exploded. Now, my previous teams, they were kind of nice. But this time, I'm not playing nice. I'm playing for funny numbers. Every single member is optimized beyond the boundaries of reason. I rolled six copies of Hatsune Miku, and now I can kill Tortellini in two attacks. It, uh, cost $50. Also, Bruce can, uh, fly. Like, actual flight. It breaks, Let's like, half Bruce. the game's AI when you do it. They're just very confused. My entire team is him shooting down at the peasants like an attack helicopter. Just, uh, don't ask me how long I farmed for this. I had to grind for this view. What was he grinding Just, for? I want to see what he was grinding uh, for. Don't ask me how long I farmed for this. I had to. Stevie, it hates. Ladies and gentlemen, Genshin has side boob. Genshin has side boob. Can all the haters please sit down? Every hater out there, just just shut up, haters. Y'all don't know nothing. Grinder. Hang on a fucking second. She's wearing socks in the water. <laughs> Something is horribly wrong with this country. <laughs> Inazuma is a third world isolationist dictatorship, mostly occupied by catastrophic disasters, both natural and man-made, but mostly man-made. Me and the fellas watching Oppenheimer in the IMAX. Inazuma is also engulfed in a decades-long civil war, resulting in mass unemployment and a refugee crisis. Naturally, this is reflected in the enemy variety, because to visit Inazuma is to be accosted by hundreds of jacked homeless people. Like, these guys just stand in the rain all day. How do the Hillitrolls have more shelter than this? It is also a land of many islands, which all act as their own individual insurgencies. So, I think this is a great opportunity to educate you as to why you should never visit Inazuma. You know, besides uh, the fucking puzzles. This shit is the work of Satan. Narugami Island is the only- Dude, I hate puzzles in games like this. Every single time. No one likes the puzzles. People want to finish the puzzles. Literally, no one likes puzzles in games like this. Place in Inazuma resembling a civilization. The rest is basically just Martin Luther King Boulevard. The only disaster this it's island filler. has to worry about is the government. And her name is the Raiden Shogun. Kanazuka is the first island to be made uninhabitable by nuclear weapons testing, which then proceeds to leak out of the elephant's foot in an amount so dangerous it makes Chernobyl look like Clown College. I mean, Damn. I guess there's also the Kujo encampment, but uh, we don't go to the Kujo encampment. Well, that's enough of that. Wait a minute. What the fuck? 
Yashiori is an absolute okay. nightmare on account of the non-stop lightning storm and a uh, slightly imposing giant skull. My favorite activity is uh, going to this place. It limits the land the lightning can strike, so it just fucking whacks you. Looks like another beautiful day in the great land of Inazuma. Of course, I could fix the problem if I wanted to, but when I began the quest to remove the lightning, I was struck by it. I'm gonna take that as a sign from God. Seirai Island is what happens when Mr. Beast donates 50 megatons of ionizing radiation to family Sabine. Like, this shit makes Evangelion look like a comedy special. The fact that there aren't even homeless people here probably tells you all you need to know. Surumi <laughs> Island is a very isolated place. Dude, every, every country that all the homeless people hate you because the government's evil in every single one of these countries except for this one why is this video just memes and shit posts loosely strung together bro this is an editing masterpiece it's populated for thousands of years by you. bird worshiping savages who need their mineral resources exploited president biden please send raytheon missiles so i can buy just sawny water and cheetos i just think it has something to do with the uh interdimensional dog watatsumi island is uh of course there's an interdimensional dog why not really nice like what the fuck does this even count as an island it's just so beautiful I sure hope it's not hiding some kind of horrifying dark secret. Damn. That's rough, buddy. Oh. Enkonomia is fucking Atlantis. You get there by jumping into the giant hole, and it's like, how is this legal? Are the developers okay? This place was once home to a thriving civilization, which collapsed nearly instantly after they discovered TikTok. It also allows me to toggle the powers of the artificial sun. And, uh, holy shit, this 5G connection is crazy. Look, I think you've got the idea at this point. As much as I've talked about reactions and, uh, children, Genshin Impact at its core is an exploration game, because it makes you explore your sexuality, and that fact- Thank you! That's what I'm talking about! Yeah, it's an exploration game where you're exploring the thighs of the these waifus, and if you could see beneath their skirts. It's Inazuma, one of the best areas. If you don't count the story, please kill me, mommy. I've been a bad. <laughs> it's the best area if you don't count the story. That is the best way to say that the story is ass I've ever heard. Boy, and okay, this nation might be lacking in housing, basic infrastructure, and some unbombed land. But honestly, that's just part of the rustic charm. Not a good sign if you're saying that the land is here's some unbombed land. Just means that the standard land in that area is, well, bombed. How else do you think this island got a giant crater? Just, uh, be glad you don't have to live in Inazuma. It's all fun and games until you piss off the geometry. No, not geometry! Dude, I love anime games in general, or just, like, crazy sci-fi anime, where the final enemies are just geometry. Just random shapes that are all powerful. Hi guys, it's me, Goro. Goro, oh, is that peanut butter? <laughs> what the fuck? Damn. All right, fellas, for our next stop, we're going to enter the weed land. We need to smoke that Zaza and fall unconscious. And to yeah! do that, all we have to do is not be stuck in Inazuma. So if you were a fan of our undersea adventure, then don't worry. This glitch is much worse. All we've got to do is, uh, whatever that was. I can't let go of the W button, by the way. Get ready to receive some Holy Spirit. Uh, okay, so we're just, we're just going down to, we're, we're going to, we're going to Silent Hill now. Sorry, guys, it looks like we're, uh, approaching Meltdown. Uh, hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Maxo. <laughs> uh, one second, guys, my mom's calling me. Uh, hey, Bob, one second. I'm flying to get that Zaza. What does that mean? It means I'm low-key in a battle bus. Sometimes I wish you were normal. Okay, uh, where are we dropping, boys? Damn. Heads are up, buddy. Perfect landing. Dude, the editing is so good. It's insane. Hey there, my little genshits. Welcome to the land of Sumeria. Wait, was there underboob? Hold on. Save me! Enhance! It's welcome to the land of Sumeria. Uh, Sumeru. Hit tight jump scare. The only nation in Genshin Impact that- No! It wasn't under boob chat. We're safe. Can use the internet, mostly for racism. Good to see that nothing- It is also um, absurdly gigantic. Like, the map screen can't even see all of it. But before we can get into the intricacies of Sumerian society- I Who cares about the intricacies of Sumerian society? I want to see the team. I want to see the squad. I want to see their butts. I have to explain my team. Thank you. Oh, I take it all back! Why are two of them children? The, uh, the kindergarten. Nahida is- All I know is that there's someone on Twitter that, that was harassing me for, uh, saying that lolly porn is weird. Their pin tweet was like one of these characters. I, I can explain. My girl a 10, but she is 10. Nahida is the literal god of knowledge. If you count knowledge as the personal thoughts of every NPC in Sumeru, which she can read, even when I log into Discord, there's no escaping her. Oh my fucking god, they're still typing it. How many emotes do these people have? Um, does watching you count as a hobby? Ah!
What? I've actually been watching you for a long time already. Excuse me, what? Nilu has a completely hollow skull. There is nothing happening inside her head. She could not pass oh. an eye exam. Saginomiya Coco. Wait a minute, I've seen you before. But fellas, I've got something to admit. You see, Kokomi's damage scales on health, her healing scales on health, and yes, even her health scales on health. So naturally, when it came time to build her, I um, used the wrong stat. It makes the numbers Let's go. Yao Yao is very cute and buddy. Her play style is chill and relaxing. In fact, you don't even have to play as Yao Yao. You play as her artificial beast given life. It uh, throws vegetables at them. How many yeah. people would you kill for Yao Yao is not the right question. The right question is how many people I would allow to live. Personally, I think this team is really okay. good for not having a DPS. And we are going to need it for all the funny and interesting events this game has to offer. Because, dear viewer, I lied to you. The best way to make money is not actually the Weasel minigame. It is participating in temporary event content, which I can only describe as punishment for developers who are too insane. Event content such as Prop Hunt, a game where you disguise yourselves as various household items to escape the wrath of very stupid people. Oh god, I think he's got a whiff. Wow, guys, this is just like Genshin Impact. Yeah, but I don't have to pay to see kids. <laughs> you know what? I think it's about time that I show off my winning strategies. Fellas, I've got a good feeling about this one. All we've got to do is, uh... Yep. Next, you gotta... You gotta do this. He will never find me this way. D does he know? Oh my god, he doesn't know. Wait a second, no. Alright, fellas, I got a plan for this map. We're just gonna stand here. He has no clue. I, I can't. Why is it working like this? I'm sorry, guys. Looking up is really hard. I am torturing this man. You could say that he's, uh, that he's among us. We also have event content like the oh, boat minigame. I'm having so much fun with the boat minigame. The Pokemon tournament arc. I, what is happening on my screen? Does that man have a fucking gun? The be beetle cockfighting. Beetle I've always wanted to be a child. Let's go. And my personal favorite, Chinese New Year. Because it makes me the most money. Just uh, don't look up any of the cutscenes. What the fuck? Was that supposed to be a rap? Why was that supposed to be some sort of rap? Oh! Any of the cutscenes. What the fuck? You wow, that was that was really bad. You know who Tao, I think you've got some hidden talent. Please keep it hidden. That rap wasn't released. It fucking escaped. Kaya, you gotta watch out, buddy. You're you're fucking you're rolling to the right too much. <laughs> Sumeru is an autocratic Orwellian surveillance state with a little hint of apartheid, governed by the worst organization imaginable, University. This nation is the land no! of knowledge, with most of it being devoted to new, more efficient ways to be racist. And so Let's go, China gang! China, where are you at? That end, Sumeru is segregated between two distinct parts, each with their own unique ways to kill you. The forest is a terrifying safari hellscape, where each animal is not only able to kill you, but is evolved to. We've got tigers, cows, crocodiles, robot dinosaur, f fungus dinosaur. <laughs> robot dinosaurs, because why not? Welcome to Jurassic Park. And my favorite animal type poor people but most importantly the Damn. forest is where the this white people so live rough. and they're filling the library with video essays this is the academia who controls Subaru by spreading misinformation on the internet Raiden the academia doesn't want you to know this but you can steal ducks from the public park the, they're free Raiden the desert is a desolate abandoned wasteland once home to a thriving civilization before the Caucasoids built a giant wall between them does does anyone else think this is weird we've got scorpions we've got scorpions welcome to Jurassic hell we've got the uh Never mind. So is he gonna like a? Uh... Okay. And we've got worm demons. But my personal favorite obstacle is definitely the gigantic fuck off laser. There are of course even more enemies, but most of them are just liberal propaganda to make you believe that race mixing is a physical need. And fellas, Damn. it's working. But hey, the desert isn't all that bad as long as you ignore the racist genie quest. Motherfucker graduated from casual to competitive racism. Right. Damn, dude, there's a lot of racism in this show. Why? Why is it so? It's so freaking China. It's crazy. Right, later, Max. What? Wait. I gotta go AFK real quick. D no! You can't do this to me! Look, the point is, Sumeru is massive. And it's not even done. And also, Leeway isn't done. And also, Mondstadt. Yeah. But what Sumeru does have is an actually good story. Like, out of all the things I expected, Harvard Building and Evangelion was not one of them. Shinji! Get the fuck out of here the right now! You can't tell me what to do anymore, Mom. I'm finally inside of another man. Shinji, what the fuck? 
I am oh. the all-knowing god. Jesus Christ, they really made this boss fight. Mobile game, by the way. So whether you're exploring deep in the woods at 4 a.m., finding amazing oasis, God, I sure hope nothing whimsical happens here. <laughs> fighting more minorities. I'm trying to be yeah! a officer, Or doing the eight-hour gnome people quest. That is, a, that is a lot of side quests. There will always be a new surprise in Sumeru. Hey, look, it's geometry, guys. And if future content is even a fraction as good as this, then I'm going to be playing this game for a very long time. Because, you know, I wasn't doing that already. What the fuck? Sido? Sido, where are you going? This man is fucking tweaking out right now. That was a great video. You know what, guys? Before I go, I want to give you all a fun tip that most Genshin players don't know. The age of consent is 18 years old. Ah! <laughs> Damn, man literally killed an entire community in one sentence. Well, in defense of uh, the Genshin Impact community, I know that no one really cares about the lore, even though you make believe you do. There are girls with big boobs, and you shouldn't make believe that you're watching it for the lore. We all know you're in it for the boobs. Just just own up to it and admit it. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe! And let me know future stuff you want me to see. Bye-bye. Like, subscribe, and follow me on Twitch. Stay weird, fam!